So we're going to look at a transition today that requires more input from the front end than the back end. So, and that is a lie to a sit position. So it's not a transition that your dog will necessarily do frequently on its own accord, um, but it's quite a good transition that we can prescribe therapeutically to engage the forelimb muscles a little bit more. Um, so all we're going to do with a lie to sit, 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 sit good boy, sit down, is get the dog to keep the back end nice and still and slowly push up from the front end. So we're extending through the elbow and the shoulder and we're engaging those shoulder muscles and the chest muscles, the pectoral region. So nice and still through the back end and we're just going to gently use the treat and guide them up. So sit, good boy. We'll just show you that again. So lie down. So nice and still through the back. Sit, good boy. Well done. So again, as with a sit to stand, um, start with one repetition and then we'll build that up as they improve and as they get stronger through there.